our 10th lab program is to uh, control a DC motor and interface it for the clockwise and anti-clockwise rotation okay it's the same as the uh, 11th program also in stepper motor but here we can't control the speed okay it will either rotate in uh, clockwise or anti-clockwise direction so let's uh, see it's working here in this working uh, this is the motor here and uh, th there are three co uh, configurations here first is clockwise second is anti-clockwise and then it is stop okay so uh, what we are trying to do here is uh, in clockwise what we'll be doing we'll have two pins here okay this is the first pin this is the second pin in each of these cases we have two pins here and if you want to rotate clockwise what we have to do you have to energize this pin okay so that it will rotate in this way else we have to uh, energize this one uh, so that it will rotate in this way okay for anti-clockwise for stopping we don't have to energize either of the pins okay so that it will uh, be in the same position okay so um, what we'll be doing here pin 30 is uh, connected for the left one and pin 31 is connected for the right one okay in pin 31 if i make it as one this will be energized if i make pin 30 as one this will be energized okay if i don't do anything it will be as zero only okay so for clockwise uh, what we'll be doing first first we'll be energizing the uh, pin 31 and then after some time it will uh, when it rotates then we'll stop it then again we'll do anti-clockwise then again we'll stop it okay and remember the code word clockwise is 8 anti-clockwise is 4 and stop is c okay uh, if you remember this code the uh, writing part of the code is very easy okay so uh, let's move on to the code here firstly we have the delay function here and in the void main uh, first we are choosing the output pins as um, 30 and 31 so we have written this code here io1 dir and here we have to set uh, for the clockwise rotation for clockwise we'll be writing 8 here okay see here remember this image uh, clock, uh, for clockwise you have to write 8 here so in the code we have written here 8 and then we'll delay it so uh, until this delay uh, until that time it will get rotated okay it will be rotating in clockwise then after that uh, gets over we have to stop the motor by using c c is for stopping and then we'll uh, delay it means after some time it will be stopped and then uh, after that we'll start the anti-clockwise rotation okay that is 4 4 is the code word for anti-clockwise rotation okay by using these three um, statements here, by 8, C and 4, we can uh, either rotate in clockwise uh, or stop uh, or stop the motor or uh, rotate in anti-clockwise direction, okay. And finally, we'll uh, write the stop, uh, stop the motor statement here and that ends the while loop, okay. And this will keep on running until we um, manually uh, switch off the power supply, okay. So that ends the program here for the uh, DC motor. And now let's move on to the next one.